Hey guys, me, CloneTuberX39, doing another video. This time it is a tutorial on how to make a custom minifigure. And a lot of you might be thinking, well, it's easy. You just do whatever you really want to. Well, yeah, but I'm going to tell you some easy techniques you can do this, how you can do this. Um, so it's mainly going to be on how to assemble your figure, how to kind of like play around with it. So to start off, we're going to make a snow German. So first thing you're going to need is to go into wherever you have all your minifigure parts, um, such as um, dump out some of your minifigure parts. Um, find some pieces you'll need, um, arms and all sorts of stuff you'll need. So we'll take these off. Um, got a torso here. You can brasso that. I actually already have a torso um, already done, so that we don't need to find. Um, so um, after you decal a torso or do whatever you want, or if it already is printed the way you want it to, you can just um, have it ready. So um, this is a custom decal torso. Decal is my design, um, so that's don't need to give any credit. But just saying, post in the comments below if you want me to sell like decals like this because I mean, look how nice and um, like smooth that looks. It looks like printing actually. And I mean, if you could feel it, even though you're just watching the video, I mean, it's like really smooth. It's not as smooth as like that, but it's pretty close. So, so far we got that. So we can let's set him right there. So, next you're gonna want to have um, so let's move all this aside okay so so far we got a torso done so let's see if we can focus that on torso at all okay so um, got the torso done now you're gonna want to go into your brick arms container for example I have my huge container here so you're going to want to go into your brick arms container, find the necessary guns you want. Um, for example, you're going to want a um, probably a Stellhelm or a German helmet, so let's set that aside over there. Also, you're going to want some sort of German gun. Um, so let's kind of look around in there, see if we find a German gun. Um, oh, there's a MG42. So we can use that and give it a little more accessories. Let's go... See if we can find a little bipod. Oh, here we go. So let's take that off this gun. Okay, so um, let's see. I don't really like that drum mag, so let's take a box mag, and we'll take this drum mag off. Okay, so we got our brick arms accessories. So let me put the camera back here. Okay, so we got our brick arms accessories. Now we need to find a head. So we'll go back into wherever you keep your heads. I have a whole new minifigure storage. Um, let's do yellow because we already got some yellow arms on there. So let's kind of find a um, good looking face because it's going to be like a machine gun face. So let's kind of look around in there. Um, let's see if we can find a real good one. Uh, okay, this is good enough. So we got our head now. Okay, so we got our head now, so let's start assembling our minifigure for what we can. So we'll take the torso, put the head on, put our helmet on, and already looking good. So that's what we got so far. Now we might want to go back into your minifigure um, place and see if you have any accessories. So let's see, we have here a backpack. So we could put that on there later. Also, we're going to need some legs. So let's look around for some legs. I don't seem to have any regular white ones, just these ones um, available at the moment. Um, so let's just do um, these legs. So let's put those on there. So um, let's zoom in a little. Okay, so we got our figure here. Let's start assembling it. Let's go put the backpack on, so we'll take these parts off, slip that backpack on, put the head back on, and the brick arms helmet. And a lot of you, if you didn't know, the brick arms helmet just barely fits on 
with the backpack, so that's nice. Uh, actually, let me do a little quick comparison here. If it actually does um, run in or bump, I think it might just a tad, but that doesn't really matter. So, um, so we got our figure here so far. So now let's um, assemble the weapons. So let's take our MG42. Um, um, magazines always go on the. Um, normally they go on the left because um, most guns are um, for right-handed people. So the magazine goes on the left. Let's put our bipod on. Put that on. So there we have it. We have our own custom German in snow uniform. So this is um, a really easy technique just to kind of sit down, go through your parts, just kind of do trial and error, just see what you like and just figure out what you like. And I think this turned out pretty good. So I'm, you might even see this in a mock. So um, that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching. Um, please comment, rate, subscribe, and see you guys later. And look out for my website. So see you guys later. Bye.